Sooner or later, everyone wants to be a rock and roller. Just ask Skid Rose, Sebastian Bach. The ultimate compliment you can give anyone, a politician, a dentist. He's rock star. That's like the ultimate accolade. And the ultimate dream of being a rock star comes true in Rock Camp the Movie, a film about rock and roll fantasy camp where real-life rock stars jam next to their real-life regular folk protégés. All started by producer David Fishoff. Why do so many rock stars like to come to your camp? They really have an amazing experience. I think it reminds them what it was like when they first started. And they see that's pure music. And it's, you know, just that these, they look at these people's faces and they say, wow, that was me. I just got lucky. Smile like the sun. Nancy Wilson of Heart is definitely an icon. And she's been a rock camp counselor, too. She's just released a new album and says her rock camp experiences take her back to the very beginning. It reminded me exactly of why I started out, because it was the love of songs, all the people I grew up listening to, and how those songs, you know, save your life. The movie stars? Ordinary folks like you and me rocking on. I actually was a rock camper for the Today Show a few years back, cranking up the volume and living the dream. Give it up for Kevin Timmels. This is rock star status. Well, thanks, Sebastian. The excitement. By the time they leave and they go back to their regular jobs, they can't wait to come back. Um, they want I, an encore. You want an encore. You want to get to that feeling that, you know, I had at rock camp. They're right. Rock and roll will never die. And this film won't let it. For today, Kevin Tibbles, NBC News, Chicago. <laughs> the best part of that piece was seeing Kevin Tibbles jamming. I, I didn't think know I would he was pick... a rock star. I oh, didn't yeah. either. Pretty impressive. <laughs> I'd pick Bon, John Bon Jovi to be my uh, counselor. What do you think? Yeah, I'd definitely <laughs> pick Bono.